At the end of the day, one team will win a match overall for the first time. Well, on paper, Krumo Vioyo certainly is the huge favorite. Only one rated in the top six, or top ten, rather. She comes in sixth. The next closest is Duluth at 16. I think Iron realized how important this start would be. Oh, Iron, can they start with a one-two finish in the 100 freestyle? Ronomi's gonna get it done, and they do go one-two. That is huge. A big start for the Iron. No question about it, because the table will most likely turn when we get to the men's 100. So you need to offset that. And Chroma Vioyo, you're right, was a late entry. At the end of the day, Roddy, it's all about momentum. Mm -hmm. yeah. And his biggest competition is going to be just inside of him in lane number three. As the 27-year-old looks to win the 200 fly for the fifth time in his career and get Tokyo on the board. Maybe, just maybe, put a little pressure on Iron. And if you are Iron, you're certainly pulling for Seto, really. You're, you're not really worried about them catching us but if you're Iron. Yep. You're just making sure that Aqua doesn't get those points, especially in a jackpot situation. Pretty tight here, quarter of the way through. Nobody else was even close to breaking 29. And the race is these two swimmers right now. Nobody else is in it. Tokyo eyeing their first win of the day. Well, to do steal it away at the end. Seto surging, and he does it in the second half of the 200 butterfly to win it for the fifth time. But still outscores Iron by six points, and that and that's one of the spots, obviously, to watch. Valenta is the only one who has won this event, and the only one rated in the top ten. There were a lot of guys, though, that were 50 point yesterday. I, I think I counted five guys that were between 50 flat and 51 flat yesterday. So this shapes up to be another tight one. And the jackpot time, two seconds in this event. Arsavich, remember, he's so good in that 200 backstroke. He won that yesterday, so he'll be able to come home. You've got to get out on him. Look at the jackpot lighting up. Is it first and third? Mora moving into position. Glinta gets it done for Iron. And they finish first and third with Revolta for Aqua wedged in between. Oh, yeah, says Glinta as he wins the hunter back for the third time at a 15 point jackpot. Talked about just chipping away event mm -hmm. by event at the lead. She's almost been as fast as Lily King this season. Yeah. Right, just to put it in perspective. Yeah, 29 flat. That ranks her in the top 10 in history in that event from yesterday. On the relay yesterday, and one of the reasons why Aqua won that 400 medley relay, and there they go. Carraro coming, surging home. Aqua, dominant in the breaststroke. Vega one, two. Created an 86 and a half, just as uh, Mark talked about those early. 12,000 plus in one event. Who has also won this event three times in two. Ah, oh, good start there by Zabo. And lane number three, 0.62 on his start. Stantos at 41. Oh my gosh. Look at the power by the 41-year-old. Look at the jackpot potential, folks. 41 ages, only a number. He almost. 
Lewis gets the record, the world record. Oh my goodness. 21.83. Fastest time in the world this year. The only guy to break 22. He was off the block quickest and it wasn't even close. He went by a body length and does he pick up some jackpot points? Look at the red screen, you betcha. 41 Nicolas Santos almost breaking the world record. Let's see if she can do it for the first time here. Great start. This crowd would go nuts. Can you imagine what this crowd would do if Pellegrini wins the 200 freestyle today? Trying to get back into the mix. Madden has finished second a couple of times. And here comes Pellegrini. She's third now, about a half a second behind. Going by Madden there. She's looking at Madden right there, Bernie. And on the way home, she'll be able to see Simonova, but Simonova is about a half body length ahead of her. What does Pellegrini have the last 25 here? A lot of work still to be done by Pellegrini. Simonova trying to hold her off for iron and get the win. And she'll do it. Pellegrini will settle for second. Iron's happy with that win by Simonova. 400 freestyle win by almost 50 points. Ahead in the standings with 440. We'll see how it plays out. Double points on the line, 18 points for the relay win. Plus for Iron, no chrome of a yo-yo. She will not be on this relay. Obviously, she, they're saving her for the skins at the end. Big surprise. I thought the breaststrokers for Aqua would go flying by Iron. Reisthammer is hanging in there. He is putting a great split in there. 56-7 for Reisthammer. That is the split of the day for the relay because he outsplit. Now he didn't outsplit Kaminga. Kaminga was 56-4, but Martin Nagy was 56-6, so he was right on. So Iron has life. That's all you want to do is give them life. Oh, and, and she's not got much of a lead. Oh, she was hurting at the end. Right into Simonova on the end. Kaminova right there in the middle with the blue cap. Watch her come off that wall. Great turn by Kaminova. Kaminova trying to charge from behind and steal it for Aqua, and she does it. A brilliant close for the Aqua Centurions. I don't Four think, one hundredths of a second yeah, to really win. I, I don't think I've ever seen anything like this. Headed to Aqua, they scored 32, and now they have 481. Well on their way to Eindhoven. It could become interesting if Iron can play this skins perfectly. That would mean Hanik and Chromo Yoyo moving all the way on to the final together. And that, a, another important reason why that medley relay is so critical in winning. Boy, very tight. You see Barrett. Chromo Yoyo looking good. Barrett taking the lead for Aqua. And Holly Barrett moves on. Two from Iron, two from Aqua. Just what we thought. And that'll pretty much do it for Aqua. I got this. Huh? I got this. Come on, come on now. Now you try everything what you have to try. Good job, Oli. Breathe. Just breathe. Relax. Good start up top. Hanik, quick off the blocks. 0.62. She was quickest off of anybody. Barrett in the mix, Chromo Yo-Yo in the mix. Looks to be two from, uh, one from Iron, one from Aqua. Haniko pressing at the end, trying to do it for Iron. Chromo yo is gonna move on as well as Barrett. One from each side, moving on.
Trying to win it for the first time this season, though. They're still breathing hard, though, boy. That's what he said. Away. Now the crucial. If not, it'll be Dia said to. He's got 50 points. Barrett looks real good. good. She was holding back on us, Rowdy. Oh, oh boy. Oh. Look at Barrett go. Don't worry about the jackpot, says Barrett. I'm going for the win. Uh, here comes Renomi, though, at the end. It's going to be tight. Barrett trying to hold her. He's got this smile saying, oh man, I'm glad this is over. She took it to Renomi, that first 25. She was quick off the blocks, Bernie. And then uh, at the very end, I don't know, man, it looks... <laughs> oh, that's it, I love it. With another phenomenal performance. They'll need him. If Zabo's ahead at 40, 45 meters, he can take it off. It's not easy to do in a 50. And if you're ironed here, you're really hoping that somehow, some way, you get two in, and Aqua gets left behind. But it's hard to imagine Zabo getting left behind. Oh, Coach, it's underneath tight. that wave. Look at him. He's still underwater. Zabo comes surging up. And Aqua! They get two to move on. Morisov wins round one. DeBoer will get second, but the key for Aqua is they move two on to the semifinals. Book your tickets, folks. Aqua's moving on to the playoffs. Literally, man. hundreds of a second. Good job, guys, good job. 12 one hundredths of a second separated one through five. Crazy. Woo. One through five. Orsi was fifth. Let's go, Seb, let's go, let's go. Morisov looks ready. He looks Woo. confident. Boy, Moresi is one big dude, man. Good start by Zabo. He was point six three. Far right, looking pretty good right now. DeBoer comes flying off the wall to try to move on for Iron and Morris has got a lot of room to work up. It looks like Zabo is gonna get eliminated as well as Barore, DeBoer, and Moresi. They move on as Iron. Oh, DeBoer jackpots Morris off. He gets 14 points. And for DeBoer, trying to get the Skins win for the second time. Iron hoping to get to some momentum okay. moving into the knockout phase. The play-in match game. 11, Wednesday and Thursday. Iron, DC Triton, New York Breakers, and Tokyo. Anything else? Grab a couple of victories. Great start there by DeBoer to start things off. He was electric off the blocks, 0.63. And DeBoer bursts into the turn, and Moresi's got to track him down the final 25. He's not Iron's going to have it. momentum moving on to the play-in as DeBoer wins the skins for the second time. They get both skins. Runomi Kromoli Yoyo takes the butterfly skins, and DeBoer takes the men's freestyle skins. They'll be a force on Wednesday and Thursday to try to knock out as the sixth and final team to automatically qualify. We will qualify two more teams this week on Wednesday and Thursday.
as Aqua can celebrate their first ever win. They can celebrate that they'll join Energy, Cali, London, Toronto, and LA in the playoffs. Between Iron, the Breakers, Tokyo Frog Kings, and DC Triton, who will take those final two spots in the ISL playoffs and Eindhoven. We can't wait to find.